Commodity Classic gives us an opportunity to engage in, with some of the very best growers and thought leaders in the industry. You know, corn, soybean, wheat, sorghum producers that are best in class. If you're looking for talking to a producer, whether it's corn, soybean, sorghum, or wheat, uh, this is the show where you need to be at because you're talking to opinion leaders, you're talking to decision makers. We really enjoy being here because we talk to the cream of the crop and again covering all the major commodity groups. So Commodity Classic is just a tremendous event for us. What I say is it's not always the acreage, it's not always the sell with this group, but it's the influence. So they may not be the largest farmer in their county, but they may have the most influence or impact on the decisions that are made in their agriculture community. If you're really looking for those, kind of the movers and shakers, I guess, uh, this is where you need to be. Absolutely, these guys are the leaders of the industry. They're the, they're the ones that are gonna go back and tell their neighbor that they're using a new product, that they heard about a new product, and, and are gonna help us to expand our market um, because they are the leaders in the industry. It's in a sense the bell cows that come here and kind of lead the development of others. And if you can get the leaders to understand the kind of technology that's available, the science that's available to better themselves, well then it will reverberate for their neighbors. I think it's really important for any company, especially in agriculture in these days, to be perceived or to have the opportunity to talk to farmers about the big picture. And so Monsanto as a company chooses to participate in Commodity Classic in these different venues. Here on the trade show floor, we can talk about our products and what we're doing. In a wind session, we can talk about what's coming in the future. But then those other educational opportunities, we can help farmers get educated overall around what's happening in ag. Well, one of the areas where the show staff and leadership has been key is with our sponsorship of the Network Cafe up outside of the registration area. So that is a, an additional sponsorship opportunity beyond just the typical booth. And it requires a lot of one-on-one -on -one with the organizers to make sure that we're uh, branding appropriately. So we'll have a win session where we pretty much talk about changes in our product line. And those are primarily directed to again, the solutions that we offer for various vertical applications. We're a gold sponsor. Um, all of the programs that people are carrying around, you'll see the green smoking N on the back, and that's, that's our logo. We're gonna be doing a taping of, uh, of an RFD TV live show. So we, in addition to that, have you know, signage within the program and uh, are so excited to be a gold level sponsor. Well, because we are a gold level sponsor, we get to go uh, tour the upcoming year's facilities which is such an outstanding opportunity. It really helps us to see if there's more opportunities for us to, to improve our branding. At Syngenta, we always say that it's important to think like a grower, and, and I think at an event like this, we get the chance to really understand what their problems are, uh, so we can take that back to, to our R&D teams and, and our people sitting in the office and, and say, this is what growers are dealing with, and this is what we learned at Commodity Classic, and, you know, it's a good it's a good place for us to exchange information. We get questions about, you know, what makes our product better than our competition because there's a lot of competition out there, and we learn from that, and it makes us a better manufacturer. We have experts here in each and every one of those product areas to really dig deep and understand what's working for them and what do they need. So it informs our innovation here at New Holland. We actually at times have customer focus groups that we've held in conjunction with Commodity Classic. Uh, we're always looking ahead to the future. What do these producers need the next five, ten years down the road? So we get great feedback from the growers that are here. Just staying really in touch with the ground and understanding uh, the language that they use now to express the, the kinds of crop production that they're doing. Show management at Commodity Classic is amazing. Uh, they go above and beyond wherever possible to make the process of planning this event and coming here and being a part of this show uh, they make it easy. I mean, easier than it should be. The show management is uh, wonderful to work with. Uh, they've uh, been involved in the trade show and this commodity classic for many, 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 many years. Uh, they know what it's all about. It's just very natural and you know that they're going to do a professional kind of job. It makes it easy for us. If we didn't feel like we were getting a return, we wouldn't be here. And uh, I think that's just a very good, plain way to put it. I mean. Again, the, the, the quality of the producer here is extremely, extremely high and we are able to have those long 
longer, deeper conversations that we can't have at another trade location. You can cover a lot of key prospects uh, in a, a relatively short period of time and they're coming to us as opposed to us going to them. It becomes, I should say, a good return on your investment for exhibiting at this show and, and being a sponsor of this show. We're starting to staff it differently because we are, this year we have a, a larger booth than we've had previously and next year we actually ordered a larger booth than this year uh, because, you know, and we're staffing it with more and more uh, personnel because of that. Well, FMC's been uh, at Commodity Classic for many, many, many years, and we've increased our involvement when it comes to sponsorship and size of booth exhibits and everything significantly over the last few years. It's an important place to meet with really top growers, the leadership of the industry. To be engaged with them and to help them understand how our products can fit into their operations um, and also understand their needs better so that we can make any adjustments within our research and our routes to market to make sure we're addressing those needs, invaluable. I highly recommend it, really. New Holland has been here for many, many years, and we highly recommend the, our, our, our other collaborators out there in this great industry to be here with us. I think you've got to come and see and believe it, and you'll be surprised at the high quality of the farmers that attend the Commodity Classic, their desire to learn, their desire to engage with you, not only on the trade show floor, but with the educational out, outreach also. There's no convincing. It's a, of course we're going to do it again. Are we going to do anything more? <laughs> it's typically the question that we get, or how can we do more?